Welcome back, everybody, to Satisfactory. I'm the Bearded OG, and in this episode, uh, we're going to have another exploration episode. And uh, we're going to grab some more hard drives. So I'm over at a hard drive that's right... Hello? Uh, that's right over by the hard drive that we weren't able to get yesterday because uh, it needed black powder and I didn't bring any with me. So... But that hard drive is actually... Let's see. Down there. Right. Um, so this is a different one. I, I thought this was the black powder one, but apparently it's not. So let's see what it wants. Speaking of hard drives, um, I also have uh, learned these alternate recipes from the drives we got in the last episode. There was also one other recipe that I learned too, but uh, the recording, the little clip that I tried to record messed up and I honestly can't remember, <laughs> remember what it was. Uh, so yeah, we got another one too. Oh, that just needs quick wire. Okay, we can do that easy peasy. And uh, before we go after that other drive, um, there is a purple slug that I noticed right over there on the way over here. Uh, so let's get our backpack on. Uh, we want to make sure it's using liquid biofuel, which it is. And let's run over and nab that. Oh, and I also have my hazmat suit now and my gas mask um, equipped. So we're in better, we're better prepared this time than we were the last time. Getting up here on foot um, would be a bit challenging. Uh, well, it would be challenging in early game because uh, not only are there critters, but um, there's a path leading up here that's blocked uh, and has a bunch of nasty plants. You know, those guys down there that you'd have to get through to get up here. But fortunately for us, we don't need to worry about that. Okay, so let's um let's go ahead and cruise on over to this other drive that needed the black powder. And then we're going to head north. Well, actually, maybe we won't. Maybe we'll stay south and go southeast. All right. Any bad bats here? You're the one that needed the black powder. Yep. Okay. Huzzah. All right, we can now remove the marker. And we're good to go. Let's take a look at the map. So, yeah, we we ended up, uh, or I ended the episode up here on this ridge the last time. Uh, there was a drive over here that has your, a bunch of uranium, and there was one here, where, what, where, you know, which also was protected by a bunch of uranium. But now we can actually go there with our hazmat suit. But since we're still south, I think we'll just keep exploring to the south and to the east and open up some more territory. Um, I think there's some kind of big crater over here, and I believe this this is the swamp. Uh, no, this is probably more the swamp over here. Um, yeah, so let's just go southeast and uh, see what there is to see. I also, maybe we'll see if we can try and get up on top of here. Yeah, there's another purple slug. Uh, I also replenished my ammo. Uh, so I've got two full stacks of home, uh, homing rifle ammo. Had a stack of turbo rifle ammo until I just blew a bunch of it up. 
And I have two stacks of explosive rebar. And you know what? We never actually tried the cluster novelisk and the pulse novelisk in the last episode. So I think maybe we should try those out. Um, let's get you out and let's go. Let's try the pulse novelisk first. Ooh, that was weird. And we'll just see what it does. I mean, I'm. My guess is it's like electromagnetic pulse. Okay, so what did that do? Did I kill him? Oh no, he's still alive. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Um. We're just gonna blow his ass up. Oh, actually, here. Let's try. Um, let's try the cluster. Oh, did that kill him? I I guess it did. Okay. Well, they're dead now. All right, we'll try the cluster on something else. So it kind of looked like the pulse novelis stunned uh, stunned the big guy, but for not not for a very long time though. He was like <laughs> back in business within a few seconds. So not too impressed with that. Um, I might maybe what I'll do is I'll do a little reading, reading up on it and see what if anything it's useful for. Right, okay, so, um, let's also, okay, so we got the pulse ready to go when the time comes. Beautiful. All right, let's move you uh, back to homing ammo. And, uh, just looking around a bit here. Oh, there's, okay, there's a drive down there. Um, am I hearing a bad guy over here? There's a purple slug way over yonder that way. Oh yeah, I've never been over here before. Interesting. Interesting place. I'm just trying to see if I could spot. Yeah, there's definitely a big guy below us. And then there's that purple slug off that way. Why don't we go down there and get that drive first, though? Yeah, let's do it. Okay, we got a bunch of nasty plants down here. So let's get these guys with you. Oh, I love the fact that we can shoot those bastards out of the sky. All right, we got a couple of small hogs. I'm gonna run out of out of fuel here. There we go. All right, well, let's just try this to see what it does. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I can get on board with that. Nice. Oh yeah. That was a that's a big guy, isn't it? Didn't we just take a big guy out with one cluster? Okay. Uh whoops. Uh I think that's a big guy too, isn't it? Oh, 
Oh, wow. These things are powerful. All right. This guy can't hurt us because we have our gas mask. The thing is, though, is... um. Uh, it does it does use the filter, so I still think I'm gonna kill those guys. Oh shit. Right, here, let's get back to here. We have a slug on the underneath side of this, I guess. Uh yeah, right there. I turned all my slugs into power shards and turned all of the plant parts into protein and all that uh, when we got back from the last trip. All right, so this guy should not be able to harm us. That's the theory anyway, so let's just see what happens. It's going to start. Yep. Uh, but it does use, uh, yeah, you can see it, as you can see, it uses our, our filter, though. So let's not waste them if we don't have to. Um, I want to get to you. Alright, let's get rid of that nasty plant down there. Really need to kill those plants. We do need to kill you, though. <laughs> Dang, that's loud. Like, it reverberates, man. Okay, what do you need? 30 megawatts. Okay, that's only one. Yeah, I guess we'll pick up seven motors. There you go. Get rid of you. I wanted to make a, a bunch of these so we could just pretty much blow the shit out of anything we wanted to. So it's, it's good as both a weapon against critters and nasty plants. So fuck off, plant. There you go. That plant was here before I was. I should be ashamed of myself. I really should. But what I should be and what I am are two different things. Okay, let's put uh, you down. Let's we'll grab a couple of bushes to put inside. So that gives us three hard drives so far. Already burned all the stuff up. Okay, so let's see where are we at. Yeah, let's just go this direction. I want to check out this uh, new biome here. Interesting. Um, so I wonder what kind of resources we have down here. I think there's coal around here. Okay, over that way. Those are normal nodes, but there's four of them. All right, I want to get up there so we can get that other purple slug. And that is a geyser, I think. Yes, it is. Okay, so... Pure geysers. Can we? And it's geysering. That's awesome. Um, What does it take to build one of these? Oh, we don't have all the stuff with us. It tells us, okay, so a pure will do two to 600 megawatts. But it has an average of 400 megawatts. That's pretty good. That's more than a fuel generator. Huh. Okay. 
The thing is, though, is I don't know how practical it would be for us to set set one up like way the hell over here, unless we were going to have some kind of an operation over here, you know. But it's good to know that that they're there. Okay, we got a lot of fart rocks up here, but we might be able to get up there from over here. So let's go ahead and... Oh, I wasn't able to get a slide in there. There we go. Ooh. Okay. Is he going to go off the edge of the cliff? That'd be funny. Alright, I need to get a, a different weapon out. Oh, you little fuckers. Follow me over here. Well, at least one of them didn't get me. Okay. Oh, the poison killed the bugs. That was awesome. Oh, and the poison killed him too, or at least weakened him. We got the final say in the deal. Uh, oh, yep, that's using our, our filters. Do I have any more normal novelists? I have one left. Okay. Let's just use it up, and that'll gain us an inventory space too. But I figured there's no point in carrying these around. You know, when we have the, the rebar. I'm liking these cluster novelists, though. My goodness. Uh, we'll have to try these out again uh, when we run into some more significant enemies. Alright. Another purple slug. And let's just kind of take a look-see from up here before we go down there. I'm wondering if there's something uh, kind of way out on that point there. Let's head that way. Blue slug down there. And of course, you know, we're keeping our eyes open for... Is that plant alive? Why is it moving? Hmm. That's weird. I don't know if they're friendly or not. Most plants that move on their own are not friendly. That's been my experience in life. Those are just little fellers down there. There's a big guy down there. All right, here. <laughs> Those things are deadly, man. Wow. Okay, we're going to make a shit ton of these when we get back to the base. Okay, we got little dudes, and there's a big guy that ran off that way. All right, let's go down. down uh, that's a that's a big boy yeah that's the one we saw earlier okay let's uh, give him some rebar explosives <laughs> direct hit okay Now, these moving plants, are they hostile? 
They look like Venus flytraps. You gonna bite me? No? Okay. Well, I'm glad you're not gonna bite me. I don't particularly like to get bitten. Especially by monster plants. Okay, let's get you out. We'll go out to the end of this uh, this point out here and then kind of cross over from there. Yeah. Homing ammo is devastating on the little guys. Okay, there's a dickweed plant. Um... Is he guarding something? Uh, I don't know. I thought m I may have heard a slug down there, but I couldn't say for sure. Night. Oh, this. Okay, so these are for nitrogen and, or for gas. That's what those are for. Okay. I knew they were for something, but I wasn't sure. Something we can also do right now, if we wanted to. Spiders. Those guys look like they're stuck up there. To that other one. I don't know. Oh, I love that. <laughs> I hear something. Oh, I think it's a Mercer Spear. Probably underneath this rock, maybe. Or way up above. Yeah, it's probably like buried inside or something. Or maybe it's underground. There's a copper node over there. So that must mean we can blow these up. That's exactly what it means. <laughs> you are so lucky that you found this most valuable artifact. I know. I'm lucky as all get out. There's, I think, a yellow slug up there. Okay. Should be able to get up to here anyway. Then we'll recharge. Yellow slug. All righty. It's cool looking. Waterfalls coming down into the abyss. Oh wow, look at those plants. Here, got a blue slug down here. Uh, bet you there's something out there too. Otherwise there wouldn't be so many fart rocks guarding it.
It's a normal copper node. Okay, so... What the hell is over there? Let's go ahead and... Oh, overshot. Let's get rid of him. Just so we have a place we can land without taking poison. Oh, there's spiders here. Shite. He's not dead. Hold still, you little bastard. There we go. Oh, really? We came all the way over here just for a Mercer Sphere? Whoa. Comply. Fuck off. Yikes. Fall down there. So that's all that's over here, huh? Your contract legally compels you to harvest this artifact. I guess that's it. I'm not grabbing that damn thing. Oh, stay away from that. Harvest. It. Whoops. Let's try that again. What the fr- Oh, you know why? Because I think I'm still going uphill. That's why my dude's not sliding. Actually, my dude's a she- there we go. It'd be cool if we could actually see what our character looks like. Like her face and stuff. Um, I don't know if does this character have a name too? Probably. Never heard if it does or not. She does. She's one badass lady though, I'll say that much. Uh, all right. We have some, oh, yeah, purple slugs and a couple of these guys. I also hear a bad bad. Is he stuck inside the stem of this thing? Either stuck inside or uh, over on this side. Oh yeah, he's stuck inside. How funny. There is a hard drive over there. And a blue slug. Okay. Make sure everybody's loaded. Grab the blue slug first. 
And I think this warrants a cluster bomb. Maybe another one a little further out there. Uh, that's further away than it looks. <laughs> okay, let's not waste any more of this. How many more do I have? I got eight more. Okay. Okay, so let's... Do this. Still only got one of them. Bacon mushroom. I hear heavy footsteps. Oh, way down there, yeah. Uh, that might be a purple slug. <laughs> he just he just bailed over the edge of the cliff into the abyss. That's funny. <coughs> we got a little bit of terrain issue right here. All right, let's see what's in this drive. 42 megawatts. All right. Two of these down. Um, I guess we'll use solar biofuel. Um, and let's just let's just throw these two hog remains in there. Oh, the solid biofuel uh, is cheaper, but. It's not like we're hurting for that stuff. Hard drive number four. All right, cool. That's some quartz. Now, I think, where was that, where were we looking down, down this way? I think that's a purple slug down there. Oh, that looks cool, those explosions. Purple slug. Look at that debris. That's <laughs> neat. <laughs> Just the way that it's flying like that. Okay. What is this? The third or fourth purple we've gotten so far? A fifth. Oh my god. We're kicking ass and taking names. Okay. Now. How do we get out of here? <laughs> um, we might want to ramp. I see a, a fart rock over there. Is there anything over here, though? No, we're just kind of down into the abyss here. Um, I'm pretty sure I can uh, make it over there. In fact, I should be able to make it to that ledge. OK, 
Okay. Look at the galaxy over there. That's neat. If we go up to here... Oh, yeah. We got this. Lemon squeezy. It's just that if you do fall, you're dead. <laughs> you know, when you fall into the abyss, that is all she wrote. Uh, bad guy somewhere. Okay. Got a sloop over there. Big dude over that way. Don't know what he might be guarding. Hard drive. Okay. Um. Let's go over there. Any bad bads? Well, besides you. God. Hit him. For Pete's sake. There are spiders around. Oh, God, there are spiders. Yes, there are. All right, you, my friend, are pissing me off. I got the wrong ammo in this. Got him. Let's, um, get rid of you. I know there's a couple spider giblets around here. Here's one. We don't need any computers. Oh, and you also need 19 megawatts. Of course you do. Why wouldn't you? Okay. Um, let's see. Uh, let's just pick a couple bushes here. Hard drive number five. Looking good. I think we were way up on top of there earlier. is funny it's it's good it's a good thing too that we can we can shoot their projectiles 
Um, there, there's his giblets. Okay, so we got a yellow slug and a swarmer plant or whatever the hell they're called. That guy's guarding something over there. I don't know what it would be. Okay, let's switch to homing. Go back to this. Well, we knocked him off. We blow him up while he's in the water. He's tough. That guy's tough. All right, let's go back to turbo ammo. All right, well, we waked him up pretty good. Didn't take much to take him out. Oh, this is a big Sam node. Completely worthless. Oh, shit. Uh, for now, anyway. It won't be uh, in 1.0, but for now, worthless. Lizard taco. Alright. Those asshole. Oh, shit. Where did you come from? Get out of here. Is that the same batch? I don't think so, because they're all flying over there. Unless one of them just stayed on my ass the whole time. Looks like maybe that's what happened. Let's go over here and get this yellow slug. There's a big hog over that way. All right, let's get him. <laughs> this thing just turns into a beast once it gets up to speed. Beautiful. Okay. Let's take a look at the map. How deep is this water? Oh, it, it's pretty deep. Okay. Let's go around this way. That's just a Mr. Bean. Just kind of looking around. Coral-looking formations are cool. Uh, there's a blue slug there. inside of the coral. We might have to blow that up. Unless I can get in there somehow. I can almost get in there. Not quite though. Yep. I think we're expected to blow that up. Just like that.
Fart Rocks, Yellow Slug, and Autosave. What do all those three things have in common? Um, I have no fucking idea, but if you guys know the answer to that, let me know, okay? hit those when they're wide open like that and they're more vulnerable. Yep, let's just keep working our way this direction and uncovering more of the map. Did we already do that drive? I don't think so because we haven't been over here yet. All right, I wonder if we can uh What happens if we throw the the pulse down there? I just want to try it again. Didn't do a damn thing. Let's try a cluster. Also didn't do a damn thing. <laughs> okay. I'm hitting the side of the cliff here. Run away! That's an encased industrial beam. Okay. That's 21 computers. I guess we'll pick 21 computers up. What do you need? Rubber. Drive number six. And why in the hell am I not researching these? I am such a noob. You guys were probably wondering that yourselves, weren't you? Okay, we got a blue slug over there, and possibly a cave. And spiders. Yay, we like spiders. Negative. Pretty damn easy to kill if they're coming right at you, though. Yeah, this isn't really a cave. It's just going underneath the big mushroom things. There's a big boy down there. Okay, there's also a Mercer Sphere. You are so lucky that you found this most valuable artifact. Okay. All right, well, 
I think we've... Son of the bitch. Let's go. Are they guarding anything? I don't know. I think we've done a pretty reasonable job of exploring this biome. Kind of fun. Never been here myself. This does kind of look like a cave. There's a sloop. And some rib cages. And a big spider. Shit. Miss me, sucker. Miss me again, sucker. There we go. Is the sloop the only thing in here? Looks like it. So let's start crawling our way out of here. I think we already did that drive. Pretty sure we were over here. Yeah, because that's where that where I said the train was kind of janked out. And that's open. Right. Okay. Getting back into grass field biome oh hello hello poppets nasty plants all right now can we cluster bomb these guys we need to get them Clustered together. Harvest. Problem is, I can't see him from here. Okay, let's grab this. Sayonara, suckers! <laughs> well, we only got one. They seem to uh, be afraid of it, too, like it makes them run away. Of course, I don't blame them for that. All right, let's get you out with some turbo. How much turbo do I have left? Eh, we got a decent amount left. All right, so this guy went over here. He was already softened up pretty good from the cluster bomb. And I would imagine this other one is too. Where'd you go? There he is. Yeah. That cluster bomb does some serious damage, man. I know I keep saying that, don't I? But I'm impressed, I gotta say. Oop, that goes down into absolutely nothing. Okay, we have a pathway up here that's blocked by some rocks and stuff. But let's just fly over the rocks. Blue slug. If we turn fog off, can we see down in there? Oh! That's weird. Okay. Well, I guess it does have a bottom. It's just so far down that, uh, except for right here. That's a little immersion breaking, so let's turn the fog back on. <laughs> Okay. 
Very interesting. Walking up this little ravine here. Let's use our homing ammo to get rid of the little guys, and then we'll blow the shit out of that dude. Ow! Take that! Man, that guy's tough. Got him. Whew. Big meanie. You want to bet there's something on top of these pillars here. Am I being spit spit at? Rude. Ah, uh, all right. Let's go over here. There's another passageway. Yellow slug and nasty plant. Let's see if we can get up here. There's a. Uh... Oh shit! Another one of you. Dirty rat. Where'd he go? They really put the big bads up here on these tops of these cliffs. See ya. Oh shit! Don't any rat. Let's... There's, okay, there's purple slug over there. I'm hearing footsteps. I think they're down below. We have radiation, but our filter is protecting us. Can we get all the way up here? Well, our filter and our suit. Yep, right there. Can we just, like, mine that? And, and does it stay radioactive in our inventory? I'm going to say probably yes. If we just dump it on the ground. Oh man, I came all the way up here for you. Well, those filters go down fast. Hey, there's a hard drive. That's why we go up high. Um Okay, let's go. Oh, damn it. Let's go here and get this purple slug.
Why are we still taking so much radiation? Okay, let's get out of here. Uh, where did I see that drive? Over there. Okay. There might be something over here, too. Just a sloop. Okay. And more radiation. You don't need anything. All right. I like free. Oh. I guess we were over here. Hmm. Why don't I why don't I remember that? Because I got a shitty memory, that's why. That is a lot of dudes. Shit. You have a path up here? He acts like he does. Why am I still fucking irradiated? Uh Okay, we gotta get out of here, man. I just realized that. Is it because I harvested that radiation and I... Because it still says we have like a maximum radiation level. I don't understand. But I'm starting to get a little concerned about it. Uh, you got to be kidding me.